everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new around here, my name is Sarah. I'm excited to have you. A little bit about myself, I'm actually a mommy to five, and on this channel, I produce a lot of motherhood lifestyle content, and a lot of that includes cleaning. So in today's video, I'm actually going to be doing a power hour clean with me. Originally, I was going to film this during nap time, but the day got away with me, so this is a post-bedtime clean. I am collaborating with an amazing lady today, Crystal Gonzalez. Be sure to check out her channel in the description box below. If you like my content, you will love hers. She's a mommy to three. She has amazing motherhood content. She does a lot of clean with me. She does routine videos, etc. Please be sure to check out her channel and let her know that I sent you. And with that, let's get right to it. We're going to start with the kitchen because it is the one room that I like to begin with. It makes me feel like I am actually accomplishing something if my dishes are done. The challenge of today's video is to see how much you can actually accomplish in a one hour power hour. I prefer to power hour clean. I feel like it's easier with children, especially when they're asleep. You don't have kids coming behind you undoing what you're trying to get done. So I went ahead and set my timer on my stove like you saw, and now I am tackling my list. And by list, I mean my list in my head of what I wanted to get done. I actually have three rooms that I'm going to be tackling during this hour, and I'm hoping that I can get it all done. have watched my channel before you know that this is normally a chore that my older kids tackle after dinner however on this particular night my husband had taken my three older kids out to go putt putting as an end of the summer fun night out so I'm going ahead and tackling all of this because honestly what else does a mom do when they have the whole house to themselves clean right I felt like I spent all of my what should have been free time cleaning the house and then when the kids got home I was like ah, why did I do that does anyone else feel me on that one like it seemed like a great idea to go ahead and just get it done while the babies were asleep and the older kids were gone but then I literally had like two minutes to myself to do nothing before they got home but at least I had a clean house Does anyone else have outdoor toys in their home at all times? With my boys, I swear we always have a bike or a scooter or some something of the sort in my house. They ride around everywhere in it and it's just kind of like a new accessory to my living room. Is anyone else like that or do you make sure that all outdoor toys stay outside?
If you watch my back to school organization video, you know that I like to have learning toys accessible for my preschooler to play with at all times. But with that comes a constant mess. These magnet tiles have become a staple of the dining room's floor. And I say dining room in quotations because we still don't have a table, but they're always all over the place. So if we classify folding laundry and watching YouTube as a break while my kids were gone and the babies were sleeping, then I did get a little bit of break time in. I love to sit and fold laundry and catch up on YouTube. Anyone else? With that being said, I am always looking for new YouTube channels to check out. I personally prefer like mommy content like Erin Williams, Brittany Bourne Leach, Beauty and the Beastins, Tara Henderson, etc. But I also love finding and supporting new smaller channels. I personally, you know, I'm in this YouTube journey as well and I have found so many amazing channels. But if you have a channel that you suggest that you really, really like, put it in the comments below. That way I can check it out. Or if you yourself are a small YouTuber, let me know in the comments below as well. I always love to check out new channels and I would love to check out yours. While we're on the topic of YouTube channels, please be sure to check out Crystal's video after you finish mine. Like I said, I'm going to link her channel in the description box below. You will love her content if you love mine. She is actually one of my new favorite channels to watch. I just love how genuine she is and she's super fun. And honestly, I just love her content. So please be sure to pop by her channel and show her some love. So with that being said, this is going to conclude today's Power Hour Clean With Me. I was able to accomplish all three rooms that were in my list in my head to get done and I finished them before the hour was over. I actually finished with 23 minutes to spare, so that always feels good. So I'm going to take a moment, sit down, finish some YouTube videos before my kids come back in, which honestly only lasted about 10 minutes. But thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you like what you see, and be sure to check out Crystals as well. Thank you all, and I'll see you on the next one.